Welcome to your reviews. This is a channel they do reviews in an easy way. We tell you how it is. Is it worth to spend the money or no? We don't give you a percentage. We don't give you A plus, C plus. It's, it's a 35%. What the heck does that mean? We tell you how it is. Is it worth to go or don't go to the movies? And now we have another movie. We start the month in February with a ghost thriller mystery movie. Winchester, Helen Mirror, Jason Clark, the same director, the Jigsaw. It's going to be good. I will start the movies this month with a good horror movie. This is not my gender. I don't have my buddy Walter with me to hold my hands today. So am I going to scream like a little baby? I'm going to fall asleep because it's going to be boring. Let's hope it's a good one. Your reviews with me, Frankie D's, Winchester, coming up. Winchester, uh, another movie. We have a new one in February. We start the month with a horror, thrilly, mystery. Uh, it's Helen Miro, Jason Clark. The same director who did the Jigsaw and they do these kind of movies. Um, I usually do it with Walter this. He couldn't do it with me this time. Uh, I gotta tell you, last year I was impressed. This is not my genre that I can do the horror movies. The Annabelle and Ed were a big thumbs up. There was a mask of movies that you should see. Uh, we had a horrible January. And I thought, you know, Helen Miro, excellent actress. Jason Berg, she's very, Jason Clark, I'm sorry. He's a very good actor. Even so, they haven't done good movies lately. And, um, The first part I can tell you is good news. It's only an hour and 35 minutes. Thank God. It's not those two hours and 20 minutes. The bad news is, it's not a good movie. It's a movie that the first hour and 10 minutes, you're gonna look and you watch many times and say, if you're tired that day and you watch a movie, you may be like, yeah, 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 okay. Because of a horror movie, nah, not much. They had this typical jumping shots. You know, you, you move the mirror, come back to the mirror, move the mirror, come back to the mirror, and then you move the same formula. If you're looking for jumping, there are five, maybe in the whole movie. I didn't jump once. I didn't scare me once. I didn't scream like a little girl. I just, I didn't need Walter to hold my hands. Ah, uh, it's a very slow. It's a true story by the the widow of Winchester, the guy who created the rifle, the multiple shot rifle, the first one ever exists in the Western in the 1800s. And uh, she's a widow and she talked to her ghosts and uh, I don't tell you a spoiler because this is part of the trailers. And uh, she's building this house to trap the ghosts. And then they design by the ghosts themselves. They just communicate with her until they figure it out. It's a humongous house, 80 rooms, uh, seven storage house. And uh, she keep building a building 24 seven. And uh, they keep adding rooms with if stairs going no place, closes, they got no insides. I mean, weird 
room, and this room, in this house exists. It's in San Jose. Uh, as a matter of fact, you can do the tour, I think, like at $50. You can do go inside and do the tour, like a museum. And uh, it's supposed to be a ghost house. And uh, she stayed there and uh, keep building and building and building. Even so, there was damage in real life by the biggest earthquake in history in San Francisco in the early 1900s. And this movie is done by 1906, uh, when they had to figure it out if she's insane or, you know, she's normal so they can just, you know, control the money the Winchester company have. It's a very boring movie, very slow. It had few champing time. There was a, oop. If you have a glass with something, it won't even move. There's no scary. It's, it's something you see this before. And uh, like I say, the best part of this movie is technically it's an hour and 40 minutes, but with the credits and the end, an hour and 35 minutes, you have to suffer. Uh, it's a go, it's a must go or don't go. No, it's a don't go, don't waste your time. Even if you have movie pass, watch another movie. It's not worth it. I mean, to be honest, it's not worth it. I know this is a true story. You have Helen Merritt, who is an unbelievable actress, but it's not worth it. Don't waste your time. It's just, I didn't see many reviews. I don't read reviews, but I can see that the press didn't have an advanced copy to see this movie because when you see that, it's because the studios, they know it's going to flop. So they try to cover as much as they can for the first week where they're going to make the money. After that, they, this is word of mouth. It's going to say, that don't waste your time. Don't just, don't go. So it's a don't go. Disappointment. I thought it's going to be a good movie. I thought it's going to be based on the true story. It could be uh, relevant on the story and the acting. And you see this before, don't waste your time. I hope you like what I say, um, don't go, don't waste your time. This is me, Frankie D, this is your reviews. If it's the first time, thank you for joining me. And this is uh, a channel that we try to do reviews of movies, TV shows, and soon will be video games. And uh, we give you the honest opinion. We don't give you, this is 45%, this is, uh, you know, it's a C plus, that doesn't make any sense. This is a go or don't go to the movies. And in this one, it's a don't go. Uh, so hope to see you next time. Until the next time, go to your movies, support, subscribe in the bottom with my face with Yoda. You're going to see my other reviews in the bottom on my right side. And uh, to the next time, keep going to the movies. And it's going to be a few movies coming up very good. And I can't wait for Black Panther. So, till the next time, joy to the movies. Thank you and ciao.